So the first difference, which is very, very obvious is Avro is a row based file format and Parquet is a column based file format. That is the very first difference we can easily think of. Now, if it is row based, we can very well say that this will be providing efficient writes, but non-efficient reads. And if it is a column based, we can say that it will provide non-efficient writes, but efficient reads. Things are reversed, right? right? So, Avro provides faster writes, but slower reads. However, Parquet offers faster reads, but slower reads. We have covered it very well. I believe that what is the reason, right? Now, other thing where I will try to differentiate these two is based on schema evolution. Avro is quite matured at schema evolution. But Parquet just supports at the end of it. That means you can you can just append or delete the columns from the end. Right? So very limited support is there in case of Parquet for schema evolution, but Avro provides a full-fledged support. So these are the some of the main differences between Avro and Parquet. Let us see that comparison between different file formats, Avro versus Parquet. Avro is a row-based file format. Parquet is a column-based. Parquet is much better for analytical querying, reads and querying are I mean because it is good for reading since it is column based. Right operations in Avro are better than Parquet. Right? Because row based provide faster writing. You know that. Now, Avro is much more mature than Parquet when it comes to schema evolution. We know this. Parquet only supports schema append, whereas Avro supports much featured schema evolution, adding, modifying columns in middle as well. Now, Parquet is ideal for querying a subset of columns in multi-column table. Avro is, is ideal in case of an ETL operation where we need to query all the columns because it is a row-based file format and whenever we are reading entire row, it is okay. Also, Parquet provides very good support for deeply nested data structures, which Avro does not offer. Parquet is very good at handling nested data. So these are the some of key differences between Avro and Parquet.